In Tableau Prep, we've got a data set here that is in a long format. Notice each student has uh, three columns here. So Alice has an exam one, an exam two, and a final exam. And I want to take this data set that is currently in a long format, and I want to convert it to a wide format, where I have one row per student, and I've got a column for exam one, exam two, and the final exam. So again, we want to convert from a long to a wide data set. So the way we're going to do this is, as always, add another step to our workflow. I'm going to come up here, and I'm going to add a pivot. Now, there's not a pivot back icon. So typically, um, we're converting from wide to long. That's the usual step, but we can go backwards. So we're going to, again, add a pivot step here. And the tricky part here is this columns to rows, right? The default is to, we're going to go from wide to long, but I want to change this. I want to go the other way. I want to go rows to columns. And notice the arrow is now going back the other way, showing that we're going to a wide format. All right, so here is the setup for this. Now, what goes here are going to be the new column headers. And so we're going to take the assessment score and that goes to be the column headers. And the scores go down here for the uh, values that will be in there. So score goes over here. So the way to remember this is these are the column headers at the top, and these are the values that go in the bottom. Now, if there were more than one observation that went in there, there would be an aggregation. Um, and in this case, the default aggregation is the summit. But you could do whatever aggregation you want. But however, because there is just one observation that fits into this cell, then the sum of one observation is just the observation, and we end up with this outcome, which is what our original outcome was. Now, we can also reorder this as usual by just grabbing things and, and moving them around and manipulating them. So we'll do exam one, and then two, and then the final exam. And this sort of undoes my initial pivot, and we're back into a data set that is in the wide format.